Uh, hi everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be taking you through the uh, Luke Kio pedals and I'm going to be giving you my overview and impressions after uh, 1000 kilometers, 1100. So let me show you here on the uh, trip. I just hit uh, 1100 uh, with my Pinarello and uh, when I bought the bike, the Luke Kio pedals were mounted uh, on it. So uh, I said let's do the review and this is going to be 100% honest uh, review from my point of view uh, by the way I'm not sponsored to uh, make this video kind of fake this is going to be 100% honest and what you can expect from these pedals with uh, with this mileage which is 1100 uh, before before we go any further hit that like if you found this useful uh, hit a subscribe over here and let's get into it right now. So, like I said, the bike came with the cheapest version of uh, Look Kio pedals. What I will do, I'm going to put a link down in the description where you can uh, purchase them on Amazon and uh, in case if you like them. And uh, let's start off first with the functionality. So, uh, let me start off by saying that I haven't done any maintenance on them whatsoever. And I'm going to just show you right now what I'm talking about. Now, look. The bearings are super smooth and I didn't do any any kind of adjustments, any kind of um, uh, servicing. Keep in mind, uh, from what I heard, they, they use uh, a sealed bearing system, which is right here. And I'm going to just show you the upper part. Like I said, this is the Kio look. So this will be their entry level uh, lineup. Uh, that starts off from the bottom. I will put a link in the description and you can see the pricing. And uh, again, speaking about the pedals, uh, I haven't done also any kind of adjustment. Uh, here there is adjustment screw right here, but I, I they never uh, kind of uh, went loose on me. They never went too tight. I just left the setting like the uh, bike came with. So the, uh, the springs that are located right here are very, very durable from what I can see. Uh, now, speaking about the cosmetic point of view, uh, I've been lucky that I didn't scrape them at, at all. Now, I'll let you have a look over here. So, cosmetically, they have a clear coat on it to protect them, what not, to prevent them from oxidation and what not. But uh, apart from the scratches here, which, which I've been pretty pleased how they held up, cosmetically, they're pretty decent. Uh, another flaw, another issue here, um, you can see here on the, on the plastic clip, which is located on the top. Uh, I'm starting to kind of get a little bit of uh, scuffing here, right here. So this is made of the rubber or plastic, but I suppose that this is the area where you're going to see some wear and tear. Uh, I would say just wear on it, so keep that in mind. Now another clip here that's on top, where the cleats uh, click in. Looks looks pretty new. So again, this is the shot. Uh, what you can expect if you see it, if you uh, from 1,000 kilometers. Now another another uh, pro here that I've been impressed is that uh, see the bearing system has held up pretty decently, and from uh, for from what you pay, uh, this is pretty remarkable. Now another benefit that I would give them uh, these are not the most uh, lightest uh, pedals. Keep in mind that that will depend on the price point, but uh, uh, the only issue that I have with them is that uh, if they were carbon, probably they would be uh, a, lo a lot lighter. So keep that in mind. But then uh, once you once you get into the, the that uh, price range, they will probably be about uh, double uh, double price wise. So keep that in mind. Now, now there's a lot of pros and cons over here. There's a lot of pros. I can't I can't think about any cons on them, because these are entry level and you 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 get you do get a lot for what you pay for. But so far, what I can say, I'm pretty impressed with it, and uh, that's pretty much that. So if you wanna uh, purchase them, there's gonna be a link in the description where you can have a look, and I'm gonna put another link where you can buy the the Kio Blade and other pricier versions. But so far, I've been I've been bl blessed blessed with the Kio look, and uh, can't go wrong with it. And that's that. Like, subscribe, and see you in the next one. Bye bye.